Bill O'Reilly here. You are listening to the O'Reilly Update, sponsored by Tax Network USA, America's number one choice for tax resolution. Please go to TNUSA.com slash bill or call 800-245-6000. Coming up next, the news with Mike Slater. Thank you, Bill. It's Friday, May 24th, 2024. Here's what's happening today in America. Donald in the Bronx, convention protests, SWAT raid, and Cosmo Kramer making a comeback. That's all coming up. Then Bill's going to be here with your message of the day. But first, Donald Trump spoke in front of a massive crowd in the South Bronx. 90-minute speech, something like 25,000 people there. You got to go listen to the whole speech. But I think the key line was when he said, it doesn't matter whether you're black or brown or white or whatever the heck color you are. It doesn't matter. We're all Americans, and we're going to pull together as Americans. I think the best anecdote I've never heard before is when he told the story of meeting the man behind Levittown, William Levitt. And William Levitt was super successful, and then he sold his company, and then he got bored of early retirement and bought his company back, but then failed. It didn't work a second time. And a young Donald Trump asked him his advice, and Levitt said, I lost my momentum. Never lose your momentum. Speaking of Trump, his campaign has accused the Secret Service of a critical error while planning to protect the Republican National Committee convention in Milwaukee. I was talking to the senator from Wisconsin, Ron Johnson, about this. And he said that the Secret Service cordoned off this park right next to the building where the convention is. And everyone needs to walk through the park in order to get inside. And Republicans are just asking for an extra block between where the event is and the designated protest area. But the Secret Service says they don't have the authority to change the plan. Of course they do. The protest zone at the Democratic convention is eight blocks away from the venue. SWAT officers swarmed a house in San Jose, California. They found inside a mini Home Depot $150,000 worth of items stolen from Home Depot stores. Home Depot spent nine months investigating these thefts, and then they handed all the information over to the local sheriff's office who executed a search warrant and arrested the suspect. More and more stores are doing the heavy lifting now beforehand to help law enforcement with these thefts. And it's about time we go after these criminals. They're making everything more expensive for the rest of us. Cosmo Kramer, Michael Richards, might be making a comeback here. He did an interview with People Magazine. It was 2006 when he said the N-word while on stage at that comedy club, 18 years ago. He's been silent ever since. He said, I said no to the offer of a star on the Hollywood Walk of Fame. I didn't feel deserving. I said no to hosting Saturday Night Live twice. I didn't feel good enough. I was never really satisfied with my Seinfeld performance. Fame magnified my insecurities. I think we can allow Michael Richards out of being ostracized, right? 18 years later, Bill O'Reilly with your message of the day. Next. If you own a vehicle with less than 200,000 miles and have an auto warranty about to expire or have no warranty at all, listen up. Car Shield has a low cost month to month vehicle protection plan that's now available to the public. Save on out of pocket expenses on future auto repairs. So please call Car Shield now. To find out how you can pay almost nothing for covered auto repairs, 800-925-7584 for a free quote. Drivers who activate the vehicle protection today will also receive free roadside assistance, free towing and car rental options at no additional cost. So please call for your free quote, 800-925-7584, 800 800- 925-7584. Hey, what do you have to lose? 800-925-7584. Time now for the O'Reilly Update message of the day. On this Friday, we are into Memorial Day weekend. Number one, you think most Americans know what Memorial Day is? Do you think they know why the nation pauses for a long three-day weekend and has fun? I'm not sure they know. I would say the majority probably, maybe it has something to do with the military, but they don't know the ultimate sacrifice that Americans should be contemplating, not celebrating, on this weekend. Here's a really provocative question. Do you think America's young people today could win a ground war against the Russians, the Chinese? I don't. Now, our technology, our military weapons, 
precludes any ground war. That's never going to happen again. That's why we don't have a draft. We have a sign-up professional military. Because the warfare will be done with fierce bombs, satellites, lasers, drones, and not guys in foxholes. We do need ground forces, obviously. But if we had to go mano a mano with the Chinese, like we did with Japan and Germany in World War II, I don't think American youth could do it. I hope I'm wrong. Happy Memorial Day. I'm Bill O'Reilly. I approve the message by writing it. You can reach me, Bill at BillOReilly.com, Bill at BillOReilly.com. Name in town if you wish to opine. Now let's go to the mail. Jillian, concierge member, and so it begins. Of course, we all knew the goal of illegal immigration was for Democrats to get new voters. Or they really aren't making any secret of it when they refuse to support a bill banning that in D.C. Absolutely right, Jillian. Right, 100%. That is what the open border is all about. Nancy Brenflick, Prescott, Arizona. Bill, I saw your update on Holly. In my daily prayer for God's blessings, including good health for you and your family, I specifically include the Corgi Holly. How nice. Holly, you doing all right? We got uh, St. Francis, named it, the Pope took his name. We're praying to him for Holly because St. Francis was the animal guy. Uh, George Sullivan, Orrington, Maine. Great Sunday column. I needed a good laugh. That is the fear and loathing column. Uh, It is posted on BillOReilly.com if you want to laugh. I appreciate it, George. Larry Dixon, Alamosa, Colorado. Your message about the path a lawyer chooses to take was very moving. I suspect your children love and appreciate you for the clarity you bring on life's major issues. Some days they do, but sometimes clarity is a pain in the butt for kids. I can't say it's across the board, but that's my responsibility. I have to be... Tell them what's going on. Um, Gary Braz, Boylston, Mass. If a warning label, sugar will kill you, is placed on ice cream, would you change your eating habits? Well, I've already changed my eating habits. So some people eat the ice cream even if it kills you, just like some people smoke if it kills you. But everybody should know what sugar can do to you. So I'm for it. In a moment, something you might not know. Your safety is important, and I am happy to introduce you to Berna, a self-defense solution that will help keep you and your family safe. Berna offers a powerful non-lethal pistol with tear gas, pepper irritants, and kinetic projectiles that disable attackers for 30 to 40 minutes. It's all legal in every state, and no background checks are required and they ship directly to your door, very private. They are American-made in Fort Wayne, Indiana, and are trusted by U.S. government agencies and hundreds of police departments. If you are a gun owner, you need options. Avoid the complexities that come with taking a life and having to defend your freedom in court. And if you're adverse to firearms, Berna is a good alternative solution. So please visit Berna.com slash bill to receive a 10% discount. That's B-Y-R-N-A dot com slash bill. Stay safe with Berna. Now the O'Reilly Update brings you something you might not know. Hollywood rapidly mobilizing to resurrect Joe Biden's faltering campaign. A few of the nation's biggest stars will gather next month in Los Angeles to boost the 81-year-old's prospects in November. The event will feature George Clooney, Julia Roberts, and Barack Obama. And there are also more famous names backing the Democrats. Here are some of them. Director Steven Spielberg and his wife each gave the Biden campaign the maximum legal limit, $929,000. Billionaire George Soros donated $900,000. Filmmaker J.J. Abrams at Star Wars wrote a check for a half a million. Other big contributors include sports executive Casey Wasserman, Lorreen Powell, the widow of Steve Jobs, and casino magnate 
Neil Bloom. Hollywood's mission is to brand Donald Trump as a fascist and cast hero Joe as a defender of democracy. That strategy will not work. Unlike Julia Roberts and the others, most voters actually go to the grocery store. They know the price of food, the price of gasoline, the price of insurance, and on and on and on. As for George Clooney in 2022, he told the BBC that America was like a battered child that needed healing from the Trump presidency. Uh, there's a lot of things that have to be repaired. You know, there's a lot of uh, oh, there's a lot of healing that has to happen. It's going to take time. It's so funny because you know he was just this knucklehead. I knew him before he was, uh, you know, a, a president. He was just a guy who was chasing girls. Now here are a few inconvenient facts for Mr. Clooney. Under President Biden, food prices up 20 percent, gas up 50 percent, mortgage rates have jumped double digits. There is a war in Ukraine, Israel, and at least 10 million illegal migrants have entered the United States through the open border. In addition, hundreds of thousands of Americans are dying from drug overdoses. So much for healing. Right, George? Back after this. Everything is expensive these days, you know that. The government is printing trillions of dollars in consumer prices higher than ever. But there are a few things you can do right now. American Hartford Gold can show you how to protect your money, your retirement, your hard-earned savings against inflation by helping you diversify a portion of your portfolio into physical gold and silver. Start with a short phone call, and they can have physical gold and silver delivered right to your door or put inside your 401k or IRA. So please call or text them right now. Tell them Bill O'Reilly sent you. Call 877-444-GOLD, 877-444-GOLD, or text GOLD to 65532. Again, that's 877-444-GOLD, or text GOLD to 65532. Thank you for listening to the O'Reilly Update. I am Bill O'Reilly. No spin, just facts, and always looking out for you. 